Welcome jailbreakers. Finally, it's here. The one everybody has been waiting for. Finally we have the PS3 Hin exploit officially working on the new 4.90 update. My life is getting better and better. Yes, you heard me right. It's time to get installing my boy. In this video, I will show you exactly how to install PS3 <laughs> Hin on your 4.90 firmware PS3. I guess some might be wondering, how do I know if my PS3 is compatible? Well, that's the beauty of PS3 Hin. Pretty much any PS3 can have HIN installed on it, even if it's on the latest 4.90 firmware. It's safe to say your boy has been waiting day and night in my little one-bedroom shanty of a home for this exploit to be released. And finally, I can bring the tutorial to my fellow viewers. Be sure to hit the like and subscribe button for your boy, and leave a comment if you need any help with any of the stages in this video. Guys, get ready because the waffle is over, and the tutorial is about to begin. Let's get it my boy. To start with, we'll need to head over to a laptop or PC. And by the way, it doesn't matter if it's Mac or Windows. Next, if you haven't already, you'll need to reformat your drive so that then update file can actually be installed on the PS3. Simply download an application like Rufus and you can reformat the drive using that. Simply click non-bootable on this drop-down menu, then click FAT32 or XFAT, then click start, and your USB will be formatted correctly. Now, we are ready to begin. Head over to the link in the description and download the HFW firmware. This is the firmware you'll need to be on in order to install the HIN exploit. On the page, you'll find a Mediafire link. Simply click that and download it. It'll take about a minute or so. Then, once it's done, go ahead and drag the PS3 folder over to a clean and correctly formatted USB. Then we can head over to the console for the next stage. Now, over on the console, make sure that bad boy USB is plugged in. Then head on over to system update. From here, click update via storage media. Then you should see the HFW 4.90 firmware there. Click install and let it do its thing. It will take a little while, but you and I both know it's absolutely worth it. Now, once it's done and you're back on your XMB screen, you'll need to turn the console off, and then put it into rest mode. You can do this by holding the power button for several seconds, until the console turns back off again. Then hold it down again until you hear two beeps one immediately after the other, and then boom, you're in safe mode. From here, go down to system update, and do the update again. This will ensure that the correct firmware is installed, so that nothing goes wrong during the installation process later on. Once you've done this, and you've agreed to all the things that pop up, you should again end up back on the XMB screen. Now, we can get to the good part brothers. From here, head on over to the Internet Explorer, then press triangle, go to tools, and you must clear the cookies the search history, and the cache. This is pretty much standard practice whenever you install an exploit or jailbreak on a PS3. After you've done this, then press triangle again. Go to tools, home page, and make sure you set it as a blank page. Now, press start, and type in the same address that I do. I will provide it in the description and in the pinned comment below this video. Once you're on the page, now click select, and bookmark the page before continuing. Now, in the top left, you should see a drop-down menu called PS3 HIN. Click this, then click PS3 HIN Installer. From here, click on the Installer button just like I do, and wait for it to download. I will speed up the footage so you can see exactly how I do it without cutting any parts of the video out. If you get this error screen, that is no worries guys, in fact, it's part of the process. Simply press select, and bookmark this new page. Now, 
back out of the internet browser. Then go back onto it, press select, and load up the installer page again. When you click on the installer button again, it should be done and this green message should pop up. Now, you're truly cooking. Click on install hen. It's the button below the first one you clicked. A download will begin that will take roughly a minute or two. Once it's done, and the install completes, go back to the XMB. And then you should notice that your PS3 screen goes black and restarts. This is good. After this, when loading up, you should see the PS3 hen symbol. Once you're back onto the XMB, go ahead and click on the HIN application that you now have in your games column, and it will activate HIN for you automatically. Congratulations guys, you've successfully installed the HIN exploit on your PlayStation 3 device. And just to prove that I did this on the latest firmware, I will go to system settings and show you the version I'm currently on. As you can see, I'm on that pesky new 4.90 firmware that has bugged jailbreakers and hen users for weeks now. Well, it's now over guys. You can now use this hen and all its new features. If you would like a further video explaining how to install different menus for various games, or what exactly the new features are on this new hen exploit, then just leave a comment and let me know. You know your boy is always happy to help. Cheers for watching my boy. If you want to take the next step up with jailbreaking, then you should check out my custom firmware tutorial that I posted days ago. It is working for the latest 4.90 update also. That jailbreak is far more advanced than the standard hen, but it certainly can come with a level of risk. Check out the video pinned below if you're interested. Also on my channel you'll be able to find a playlist that is dedicated to PlayStation 3 jailbreak tutorials that are in the most simple form possible. These videos include methods such as installing any of the popular homebrew applications, how to get online and bypass new updates when they come out, how to install alternatives to hen and custom firmware, how to install different menus for different games such as GTA or Call of Duty, and so much more my boy. Whatever issue you might be facing on your PS3 jailbreaking journey, I can guarantee you I have posted a video on how to fix it. Thanks for watching my boy. Be sure to leave a like and maybe a cheeky subscribe for your boy on your way out. This is now the official hub of all PS3 and PS4 jailbreak related content. Cheers guys and peace.